fallout continues from President Trump's trade wars, with many farmers feeling the effects firsthand. And because of that, some of them are leaving their crops and livestock behind and heading to Washington to raise their concerns face to face with lawmakers. NBC's Vaughn Hilliard is on Capitol Hill with one of those farmers. What are you seeing and hearing there, Vaughn? Chris, for the last month and a half, we've had the opportunity to travel around visiting a lot of different industries, particularly ag industries that have been impacted by those retaliatory tariffs from Mexico, from the EU, from China, from Mexico. And actually, the very first individual we met back on June 1st at his Decorah, Iowa farm was Bob Hemeseth. You farm corn and you're also a pork producer, 40,000 hogs a year, 2,600 acres of corn. I think when we first met you there, what, the corn is about three inches high? How, how tall is it now? Well, the corn's head high right now, so it's uh, grown a lot since the last time we talked. Eight, 10 feet? Yes. Now, when we talked a month and a half ago, you were telling me that you were hopeful that the president's trade efforts were gonna be able to get better deals for ag economy. Yet, you are also skeptical and, and a little fearful of what would come if this prolonged much longer. Today, a month and a half later, what are your concerns and what's your message to the White House? Well, our concerns is that uh, we're seeing this escalate. Um, we're seeing these tariffs being po being imposed on on the products we produce, and our message simply is is that we need to get these re trade issues resolved. We need to keep these markets open, and we need to get things going because we're we're hurting out here economically. We are going, you are, we're going to be joining you. He's going to be meeting with Senator Grassley, Senator Ernst, and a couple congressmen from Iowa, his delegation. We met up with them yesterday and asked them the very specific question that Bob is going to be coming and visiting you. What is your message? What are you doing on behalf of farmers like Bob? This is what they told us. I've had at least three occasions to talk directly to the President of the United States at the White House with the support of other senators on this issue, the catastrophic impact is having on prices and the distress it's bringing to American uh, farmers generally. I understand the president's efforts, but we are caught in the crosshairs. We have to get trade deals done now. It, it's imperative. We are feeling the pinch now at the markets as hogs go down, as corn goes down, and our young farmers, they may not be able to sustain the, the pace of the low markets. Your two senators just there that we just heard from note the immediate impact that this will have on farmers like you. What is it that you want from your Republican lawmakers, your delegation here in Washington, D.C.? Uh, I want them to continue the strong message that, uh, that these export markets are important and that we need to get these trade issues resolved as soon as possible so that we can to have some certainty in the marketplace and so that we can get back to uh, uh, opening these markets and selling products to these countries. Bob, thank you. Chris, we're going to be with Bob throughout the day as he visits office to office here on Capitol Hill with that very message. Chris? Vaughn, thank you very much. We'll look. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.